I'm, okay, I'm like almost nervous, okay? We're gonna flip this on, and we're gonna see if it goes. Okay. I have been waiting 25 years for this day, okay? Here is a toy from my childhood. It was my favorite toy. It is the Stegosaurus from the Dino Rider series. If there has ever been a toy line near and dear to my heart, it is this one. To this day, I'm about to, I'm about to get weird. To this day, several times a year, I have dreams where I am in a modern day toy aisle and I see that they've released Dino Riders again. And then I wake up and realize it's a dream and I'm bummed. But today, we get to relive the past. I attract a sealed copy of the Stegosaurus and I'm gonna open it up like I'm five years old again. Uh, I'm gonna show you the box, I'm gonna get it out, we're gonna see everything how this works, but if you're new to Dino Riders, I'm gonna show you how awesome they are. So these people from the future warp back in time and they're suddenly on Earth with dinosaurs. They're battling against each other, so they put laser beams on the dinosaurs and they fight with them. It's the coolest, it's the coolest thing. It's the best concept ever, okay? Watch, this is them trapping the T-Rex. Oh, they got him! Wait for the brain box. That's it, that's the brain box. Watch his eyes when this happens, watch it. It went red. I don't know if you can see that because of the cell phone. They got the T-Rex! That's, 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 that's this! The good guys could talk to the freaking dinosaurs with things. They like to talk to them psychically. They don't make cartoons like this anymore. This, it's so awesome. But the toy line was probably better than the cartoon. The cartoon was awesome. The toy line was knocked it out of the park. But look at the production value that they put into these toy commercials. Quickly, we'll have to trap them in the canyon. Look how awesome this commercial is. Here's the, here's the toy we're playing with. The Stegosaurus. Take this, lizard lips. So now you have a base of what Dino Riders is all about, and you clearly see I'm passionate about it. Uh, it's near and dear to my heart. My dream, Mattel owns the rights to Dino Riders. Mattel, if you need someone to like head the project on bringing Dino Riders back, I am your dude. Contact me. I will I will do it. Uh, but today we're going to dive into the Stegosaurus. Uh, another thing is, back in the 80s, people, everything was done with love and care. This box, look at the artwork. It is beautiful. Uh, and now this box has been got wet and it's been warped and it's not in good condition. I do have another copy of this that's pristine that's in my collection. This video is really for you 70 and 80s babies that uh, remember this, but uh, go on the journey if you don't. Most of the bigger dinosaurs had this flap that came up and you could actually see inside. How cool is that? It's kind of hard to see with the glare. There's the lasers, you see those? Um, there's the two figures. It comes with Tark and Vega. Um, the figures were tiny, but I liked that. I liked it a lot. The side of the box kind of showed you what it did. This one actually takes a battery and can walk by itself, uh, which you would see in the, like those overproduced commercials. Really well done. With love and care, like I said, all sides of the box, you are getting something that just looks so, so cool. Look at this like painting of a whole like battle going on. It's just a beautiful box. Like this, if you're a Dino Riders fan, like, Having a collection and able to look at all the boxes and like the just the everything that goes into it It is a beautiful collection even if it's warped like this. Let's crack it open when I track this down it, Oh wait, no, this is definitely sealed barely. This has been a long 30 years for this box This set would definitely cost hundreds of dollars, but when it was bought it was 1999 back in the late 80s I haven't done this since I was a child. Oh Gosh, I want to take care of the box It's so yellowed. Here it is, all right, so we got the lasers. Okay, we're gonna put this all together. We're gonna get a battery in there and hopefully it works. Oh, this really is brand new. This is so brand new. It's got little rubber pads because it walked. Everything was built better back then too. All right, let's get our actual Dino Riders out. Here they are. They stand pretty good. Like I didn't, I did not have to do much to get those dudes to stand. All right, the top shell is done, and boy, that is yellow. I don't know if you guys can see that. That is from the 80s. Um, the second one. Oh no! So you know the box was warped. Some rain did get in, and there's some like like some gunk. So there was definitely this. 
this box got really wet. I really hope the dinosaur still works. Uh, it being electronic, there's a good chance that it doesn't. But it is in pristine condition aside from that. Um, we can clean this out, that's not a big deal. And then it has this little bag. This was super cool. Uh, oh, please don't rip it. I think we're gonna get, I think, I think we're good. Oh, it did rip it a little bit. Like I said, they put love and care into things they did back then. You always got a little comic book with it and then it shows you a lot of the toys too, it should, yeah. Look at all of the toys. Guys, go into Deep Dive with Dino Riders and just look at the beautiful other dinosaur sets you can get from this. Uh, but here is the stuff that's gonna hold it all together. This is absolutely sealed. This has never been opened. And then the figures always came with these, and these are like accessories for the figures. Um, oh, oh, and we got the instructions. Boom. I got bought a Lego set, well, not too recently, that made me get on my phone to look at instructions. You know what? That's for another conversation. Okay, let's get these out and start putting it together. I feel like I don't actually need to get these out, but for the sake of doing this video, I will show you what these are all about. There are two figures, so they put two of these in here. And if you had Dino Riders toys, you had so many of these. Uh, but what is cool is we'll get this one out. We'll get the blaster out too. When I said that the good guys can like telepathically talk, so this little amulet they wear on their necklace, that's how they did it. That's a cool accessory. Because you saw it in the cartoon, and then you got to like play with it with the toys. Another accessory was cool. They had these little wrist like lasers that would go on their arms. See that little, like a silver laser thing? That's all that took back then. Uh, I will say weapons are better these days for action figures, but the attention to detail on the actual action figures, I love it. Especially the bad guys. The bad guys were really cool looking. And then this is a more heavy duty blaster. Can you see that? It's like on his arm. Pretty cool. Let's put this baby together. And you know what? I'm gonna use the instructions. That goes on great actually. Okay, I hope the next one goes on that good. It did! <laughs> you got some leg warmers, Stegosaurus. All right, uh, this is so cool. I have not done this in a very long time. Okay, how do I, how do, I do it? All right, so this, I think this goes like towards the front. Oh my gosh. I have not done that since I was like five years old, six years old, okay. Oh, it like locks in. Gosh, that's awesome. Look at him. Okay. So this is a good guy dinosaur, which is the Valorians and the Rulons, the bad guys, and they had the brain boxes. The brain boxes are really cool, but we're doing a good guy dinosaur today. Oh, look at him. He's got that on him. That's pretty cool. Oh, this goes over here. I can't believe I'm doing this. I'm sorry, I have a broken record. This is just, I have dreamt of this day for a long time, okay. So I think these lasers are the coolest. And I guess you could customize this however you want, but I'm gonna make it how it is supposed to be on the box. I've got these that just fit in. These like rockets on this side. And then we're gonna take these, which you saw at the begin in the front of the box. These were like, I, I noticed that I was like, they didn't have the red caps on them. And you gotta put the red things on yourself. And that like, so that's the iconic Dino Rider look of a laser to me. And then one more, then we're done. Oh, the battery, of course. You know what, I'm gonna flip this thing upside down. All right, laser beams, boom. Okay, and we can actually put our dudes right inside. Oh, this is the coolest thing I've ever done, okay. Look at this. Are you guys seeing, are you guys seeing this? All right, now we're gonna put this it looks good. Like, I don't see any water damage in there. We're gonna put our 1C battery in. <sighs> I'm, okay, I'm like almost nervous, okay? We're gonna flip this on, and we're gonna see if it goes. Okay. Oh, turn around. The bad guys are that way. I'm a, I'm a kid on Christmas right now. Don't walk away from me. Okay. I don't think this is just nostalgia. I think this is a home run, knocked out of the ballpark toy. And there were so many of these. In fact, 
We got one right here. This is the Dimetrodon. Another really cool dinosaur. If this is just summoning all the nostalgia for all you 70s and 80s babies, um, you can get like used ones that like are that's been played with, I think for a decent price. Um, but like a, a, the brand new stuff is like, it's just, it's, it's unfortunately a little expensive. But I got this, I, I actually got this a couple years back and it's just been staring at me because I knew I wanted to do this and I wanted to film it and capture it. Uh, and it is just so awesome. I'm going to take this home and play with my kids and show them this. And my, I have three children who are usually on this channel with me. This is a very different Turbo Toy time. Um, but they are no stranger to Dino Riders because I've showed them the the cartoons and gotten my old toys out. So to play with a brand new one, I think they're gonna be really excited, but uh, I'm gonna, supervise over this and make sure it's not destroyed. Um, this is very, very cool. I'm so happy. Thank you for going on this adventure with me. If you want to see more videos like this, let me know. This video is kind of for the 70s and 80s babies. At any age, you could get something from this video and be entertained by it. Um, but that's it. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, I do very different videos. I usually do videos with my children playing fun games and stuff on this channel. Uh, so I'm not going to do this all the time, but maybe every once in a while. Um, hit the subscribe button if you want to see more toy fun. Um, and if you do like this, maybe I'll do more old, you know, retro openings like that. Vintage? Vintage openings? That's vintage at this point, right? I don't know. All right, I'm done. Thank you for watching. Peace to the Dino Riders out. Oh, and Mattel, call me! I will, I will work for you and we'll relaunch this. I'm done. Have a good one.